<clears throat> My name is Zoe Baila. Um, yeah, I'm a musician. Yeah, with classical background, you know, I uh, grew up in the church and so on. Yeah, otherwise I'm a start off as a singer, otherwise I'm a music maker and storyteller, I guess. As a person that has really grown up to understand that things are not the way they are just because they are like that. Uh, not a lot of our challenges that, that we have today in the world are by default, but they by design. And I've seen how systems are put in place in order to advance a particular move <coughs> and, uh, and, and how easily manipulated the human mind is. I, at a very young age, I went to a, a, a predominantly white school. In fact, it was a white school. And as the only black boy there for two years, I got to really understand like, mm, okay. Basically, there's programming that happens. And I mean, those kids were, yes, you could say they were racist to me or whatever, but I could tell that it's not really them. It's their parents. It's, 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 it's what they hear, but they do not understand. But the more they got to live with me, I mean, we would showering together i mean we were basically living yeah. together in the in, in in the hostels and and they were making their own discoveries you know and then you'll get like uh jesus why are you not like the other blacks or whatever you know what i'm saying so and and i check in south in in africa especially in south africa we've got uh you know the xenophobia challenges uh you know where south africans you know are treating badly uh, other uh, nationals from other countries on the continent and 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 I know that it's like from us not knowing each other, you know, we're divided and only to find that we actually are the same people. Uh, so it comes a lot from not understanding and knowing each other. Uh, fear can cause that. Uh, so I'm a person that is that is against othering, but it's all in the education and, and, and the understanding. So I support peace one day because they're bringing something that is close to heart. I'm not an activist. Yeah, you know, yeah, that other side, that other side. I understand a lot of people and I'm about, uh, you know, coming together. And in order to have peace, we need to have an understanding, uh, emotional awareness and um, and just consciousness, enlightenment of the spirit and of the mind. Music has always played a very vital role. Um, those that have used it in the past to, in order to, like I've said, in order to advance their own uh, agendas in manipulating uh, peoples, they've known this thing about music being a powerful medium. We know it uh, during the apartheid era that uh, whenever we'd get, to, we'd gather together, there's freedom songs, there's uh, you know, your humor segelas and uh, other guys that were in exile that were using music because it was something so close to their heart and because it was so moving and they were so attached to it emotionally, music really played a role. Uh, uh, um, music can be used, it can really work. It's, it's the one thing that, that can get everybody uh, uh, on the same word at the same time. Yeah. You know, you can be of one mind, uh, same thinking, but you're not necessarily saying the same thing at the same time. So uh, I think it's uh, music is just it, man. You know, uh, one thing I'd say to the next generation is, uh, you know, to just be fascinated by life. Uh, you never stop learning. That's course of it. You know, you just never stop learning. Uh, the more you grow is the more you learn. And uh, the more you know is the more you realize how little you know. But once you tell yourself that you, you know it all, you've made a conclusion and you cannot make a conclusion. Things can keep surprising you. So uh, that kind of attitude towards life <clears throat> can really uh, help people in wanting to discover more things about people that are coming from different backgrounds to them. What shapes us is, is yes, who we are, but also uh, where we come from. And that can uh, uh, not only just uh, be disadvantageous, but it can also benefit, uh, uh, you know, our outlook and, and our motive and our drive and everything that we do. Uh, you know, when you look at people that have really made a significant, a significant impact on the world, 
uh, it's not really what they've done that really, or just what they've done that really uh, inspires people, but it's it's their stories. Yeah. Uh, there's a song I'm singing uh, about Mandela being in solitary confinement. And, and, and now that you know what has become of him and he became the president, that's what's touching. Coming from that, what he's gone through, Yes, he's a great statesman. You know what I'm saying? He's not yeah. necessarily the best president or whatever, but it's the stories. Uh, uh, and that's what's motivating. So to not be ashamed of who you are and know that you are that uh, and you are not the only person with a story. So be interested, be intrigued, be fascinated by, you know, what happens. And, and, and that's what uh, uh, helps us get a better perspective and, 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 and enough reference for us to draw from in order to, to, to progress. Kugu te kaya Ti la segi le Ti funu godu ka Angutembegile, <laughs> Sendi hambe mazwe kodwa eti naha kia kumbula Sikula kwa makulu kuneko mine nga mandanga Singa hiboni na lontlupego Imini zinga fani kwa zinya singa lali Zizi lilo himi ngili Yo, sasitale mlancheni noba hunga ganani Sadis are cooler. Sassy city, dizzy, 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 noble and dizzy, dizzy, Kamapinga, Baveni Bayadi Funza, Dinlo Dinom Bilini, Lali City Lichoni Langa, Uyas Yong Hai Kribanga, Nangom Toyayi Mini Sassi City, Dizzy Dizzy, Dizzy, No Lana. Oh, la, la, la.